We're going to demonstrate how to use the PowerForms Designer to customize the look and feel of the default new form in a list. First of all, we have to register PowerForms for the list's new form using the buttons in the upper right corner of the ribbon menu. Once the default PowerForm appears, use the Design Form button to open the Designer. The Designer uses a simple drag and drop and what you see is what you get logic, providing the user with the capability to split the controls into tabs and sections. We can add a new control to our design area by dragging the desired type from the toolbox on the right. Sections, which are the main containers for the controls, can be customized to split in numerous columns with parameterized borders, widths, colors, and expand collapse capabilities. Depending on the business need, external information from SharePoint or other sources may be required. List queries can be defined to retrieve data from any SharePoint site, list or document library based on fully parametric criteria. The queries can be used to feed values, lookup ranges, formulas and constraints to every asset in our form. For instance, you can have a text box retrieve its inner text from a specific list item's column value simply by selecting the desired list query. The designer keeps a table layout approach for positioning the UI elements. Controls can be easily rearranged within the form from section to section and can be set to expand their width to more than one columns for more flexibility. Once we are happy with our design, just press the Save button to store our form customization. PowerForms offer a great variety of controls suiting any possible data type or business scenario. The controls can interact with each other to produce automatic calculations, data retrievals, and master detail views. Thank you for watching.